Oh, it's a lovely day out there today, so I'm going to go for a walk. You know, there's loads of renewable sources of energy like wind, sunlight, heat from the earth and the air. And with micro-generation technology, we can make use of that, saving even more money. First up, solar photovoltaics, or solar PV to you and me. They fit on your roof and they convert sunlight into electricity, so you can run your appliances and your lighting in your home. Solar PV will work in any weather as long as there's daylight, so our unpredictable weather is not a problem. Solar PV only produces electricity in daylight. It's not stored, so you'll get the greatest benefit if you use your appliances in the day. Great for roofs facing south, and that are big enough for the system. They reduce your electricity bills as well. If you have a prepayment meter, make sure you don't run out of credit because the panel will trip out and your landlord will need to reset it. Solar thermal panels use the sun's energy to heat the water in your home. Like solar PV, they also fit on your roof. You'll need a hot water cylinder for thermal panels, but if you're like me and you've got a combi boiler, it may not be appropriate. Solar thermal panels work all year round, but you may need your boiler or immersion heater to heat the water further in the winter. It's best to use the water during the day while it's still hot. It's great for roofs facing south that are big enough for the system. They can provide up to 70% of your hot water needs and it lowers your carbon footprint. Ground source heat pumps are a loop of pipe buried underground which extracts heat to heat your hot water supply. They release a constant but low temperature of heat into your home so your radiator won't be hot to the touch. Ground source heat pumps are low maintenance and great for rural areas and properties without a gas supply. You'll need enough land to install the system and a well insulated home for it to be effective. Air source heat pumps differ from ground source heat pumps in that they extract heat from the air before converting it into energy for hot water and heating but like ground source heat pumps, they too release low constant temperature heat into your home. An air source heat pump is about the size of a small fridge. It's similar to an air conditioning unit and it sits outside. It's great for rural areas and properties without a gas supply, but you will need a well insulated home for the heating system to be effective. Well, that just about covers it. Whatever steps you decide to take, more information is available from your landlord. Whether it's big ideas like micro-generation or small changes like turning your thermostat down, there's loads of ways that you can save energy and reduce your bills. So start saving today.